What is up everybody, Garden State Aviation here, back with another video. This is NG Models November 2021 releases. Without further ado, let's get started. Starting off at the top of the list, we have a Flair Airlines 737-800. This is in their 1-400 to scale, despite what it says on NG Models' website. It looks pretty nice, and uh, if I could, I would get it. If I have a little bit of money left over from releases this month, I'll actually go for this. But uh, yeah, registration is Charlie Foxtrot Foxtrot Lima Alpha CFFLA, and it is scale 1 to 400. Moving on down the line, we have a 1 to 200 Nigerian Air Force Dassault Falcon 7X. It looks pretty nice, and um, but it is quite Euro white. Anyway, the registration is 5 November Foxtrot Golf Victor. 5NFGV, and it is scale 1 to 200. Continuing on down the line, we have two Virgin Australia 737-700s. The first one is named Kingston Beach and has the registration Victor Hotel Victor Bravo Yankee. The second one is another Virgin Australia 737-700, except this one is named Cronulla Beach, and the registration is Victor Hotel Victor Bravo Zulu. Both of them are in 1 to 400 scale. Moving up a scale, not scale, of size, we have a Malaysia 737-800. This is in their Negaraku One World livery. Uh, the Negaraku livery, obviously, is the Malaysian flag in the back, and then the One World sticker as well, the One World sticker. Registration on this model is 9 Mike Mike X-Ray Charlie 9 MMXC, and it is scale 1 to 400. Continuing on down the line, we have two Alitalia A330-200s. The first one is a repurposed Alitalia AT3200 because obviously Alitalia ceased operations. This one has a little ITA sticker and the registration on this one is Echo India, Echo Juliet November, I think. Yeah, Echo Juliet November and this one is named uh, Tu Tintoretto or Tintoretto. The second Alitalia AT3200 is Echo India, Echo Juliet Kilo, and this one has not been repurposed by ITA, and it's an Alitalia's old-ish livery. Now, it does look a bit 3D, and I would actually want to see how uh, this looks in NG's photos, because if it looks as good as it does uh, in the clip art, then I might actually want to get this. But uh, yeah, continuing on down the line, we have two Kuwait Airways AT3200s, the first one its registration is 9 Kilo Alpha Bravo Papa, if the photo ever loads. Uh, yeah, I don't know why NG Models is always, not always, but sometimes in the releases they use jet photos rather than getting a clip out of the aircraft. But this is the really annoying thing about these photos is it does take a lot of time to load. But yeah, this is the first one in which the registration for this is 9 Kilo Alpha Papa Alpha. Uh, it's just a normal Kuwait Airlines aircraft, or Kuwait Airways, should I say. And the other one is a 9 Kilo Alpha Papa Bravo, and this one has its 65 years sticker on it. Uh, both of them are in 1 to 400 scale. And the final aircraft of this release is the Tupolev Tu-104, sorry, not 104, Tupolev Tu-204 from Mahan Air. This looks really, really nice, and NG models have just really been milking the TU-204 mold that they have. They've released a model that's a TU-204 last month, they released, I believe, two the month before, and, you know, it just keeps on coming, and that's, like, the really cool thing about this TU-204 mold is there's a lot of new possibilities with it. But, uh, yeah, registration is Sierra Uniform Echo Alpha Foxtrot, S-U-E-A-F, and it is scale 1 to 400. Now, this is quite a small release. I mean, compared to the last release, which had a lot of American models, a lot of Asian models, uh, a little bit of European in it thrown in, too. Uh, this one is actually quite small. I believe there's only 10 or 11 aircraft in this release. Uh, not even. I believe it's like 8, I think, from looking at it. So... Yeah, it's a small release aimed at a very few amount of people. Now, I do know that the flare is going to sell out really fast, uh, but that's the models. I don't know how they'll do on the shelves. But uh, yeah, I don't really need anything from this release. Uh, like I said before, I might go for the Flare 737-800, and depending on how the Alitalia looks, I might just go for it, uh, just because the livery looks really cool in the clip art. But uh, yeah, that does conclude this NG Models November 2021 releases video. If you guys like the video, please like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you just my one of videos, <laughs> one of my videos, and comment down below what you guys are getting from this release. Once again, thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in the next video.
as always, goodbye.